there are bugs here in North America that I refuse to touch. So before we dive in, do me a huge favor, smash the like button and hit subscribe. All right, let's get to the list. First up, the Velvet Ant. Cute name, horrifying reality. This isn't even an ant. It's a wingless wasp with a sting so painful it made a grown man cry on YouTube. Nope, next, the cicada killer. It's a flying tank. These wasps look like someone put a jet engine on a hornet. They're huge, they're loud, and when they fly past you, the wind alone will make you reevaluate your life. Are they aggressive? No, not really. Will I ever touch one? Absolutely not. I like my hands without holes. Third on the list is the giant water bug or toe biter. This one has the nickname toe biter. That's already enough for me. These things have giant raptor claws for grabbing prey and a needle-like beak that injects digestive enzymes. I touched one once with gloves and felt pressure right through them and said, nope, never again. Next on the list is the assassin bug or wheel bug from the kissing bug family, which by the way, if you haven't already, go ahead and kiss the subscribe button. It's the only kiss that's guaranteed not to come from a bug from under your bed. And if you're feeling brave, take a stab at the comments. Let me know what else you'd like me to talk about. Anyways, the assassin bug, the name says it all. They have long stabbing beaks they use to harpoon their prey. Or you, if you're unlucky. People say the sting is so painful they can literally feel their soul leave their body. Yeah, I'm good. I'll admire this one from a distance. And for the last one, the cutest little ball of pain you will ever see. It's called the pus caterpillar, and it looks like a tiny, adorable wig. But underneath that fur is venomous spines. It feels like being electrocuted, and those spines break off into your skin like fiberglass and will sting for hours. You think I'm touching that? Absolutely not. So yeah, I love insects. I work with them all the time, but these five, I respect them from a far distance. So if you enjoyed this, go ahead and kiss the like button and take a stab at the comments.